Are you a Browning lover? If so, here's what Browning has on offer this year. press launch of new shotguns and rifles. An A5 semi-auto shotgun, a British version of the B725, a new driven big game rifle called the Maral, and a new GRS stock for the Xbolt rifle. The reptiles have gathered at the award-winning Ian Coley Shooting School in Gloucestershire to try them out. First up, sporting shooter editor Dom Holtham finds out about the new A5. So David, we're here today to try the new Browning A5. Yes. It's a very distinctive looking gun. It certainly is, isn't it? It is. It's the, hump, it's the hump is back. The hump is back, so it has yeah. a very distinct hump it back does. here. It's a bit like it's a bit like the, the auto your granddad would have shot, the old, the old Auto 5, which had the hump, distinctive hump back. Well, on the old Auto 5, the barrel uh, recoiled, but on this one, uh, it's a totally different mechanism. It's what we call a kinematic drive. Basically, the, the energy from the first shot is used to drive the gun for the second shot. Okay. And it's all done by a spring, which is in the bolt. Uh, that's the main difference. So the, the internals are very, very simple on this gun. There's hardly anything to go wrong, which is why we guarantee it for 100,000 shots. Uh, if you're a serious gamekeeper or a vermin controller, you're using your gun in a professional capacity, you're not that fastidious about cleaning it, then I would recommend the A5 ab above the Maxis. So for, the... For, your, for your Mark Gilchrist of this world, who are not renowned for being gentle on their equipment. It's a gun for Mark Gilchrist. We nearly called it the Gilchrist. <laughs> <laughs> now, one of the lovely things about the A5 is the speed loading facility. Need to reload? It's simple. Just push the cartridges in from underneath. You can do it under pressure and without looking. However, when it comes to the official press demonstration, it's suddenly not so easy. Alternatively, you can uh, turn it upside down, use the speed load port. <laughs> Alternatively, you can turn it upside down and use the speed loading facility. So you literally just flick it in with your thumb. Good to go. Okay. Anyone could do it, even an idiot. Sadly, we couldn't find an idiot. <laughs> It always happens on camera, doesn't it? Maybe he'd be better off with a more straightforward new B725. The Browning boffins listened to the British and have come up with a new version that's designed to appeal to the UK market. Here's the verdict from Patrick Tillard of Field Sports Quarterly magazine. Yeah, yes, we had a great day, got pretty lucky with the weather. Uh, yeah, spent most of the day with the uh, B725, uh, the black model, which uh, so I've been out of practice for a bit, but it was a uh, yeah, nice gun, managed to hit a few. Uh, ground's quite testing, got harder as the day went on, but yeah, good fun, nice gun. It seems, well, having seen today the, the Browning range, uh, it seems that yeah, two to four, 4,000 pounds can buy you you know, a nice, a probably nice gun. On other products, there's a new adjustable stock for the Xbolt rifle. The big rifle launches the Maral, which comes in 308, 3006, 300 wind mag and 9.3 by 63, which you can see on the Browning stand at the CLA Game Fair. One thing's for sure, after today's launches, you will be reading a lot about these shotguns and rifles in the sporting press.